Well, good evening and thank you for joining us. Uh, it's like something out of a horror movie. A haunted house burning in the middle of the night in Parker and firefighters were able to keep the fire from spreading to the surrounding farm. But now they are investigating who might have been responsible for mm. causing it. Good evening and thank you for joining us at five. I'm Andrew Hill. I'm Shannon Ogden. Joined us now, uh, Russell Haythorn, who is live where Fright Acres used to be, Russell. So South Metro, we understand, looking for two people caught on camera leaving that haunted house last night. Yeah, that's right, Shannon. They do have video that shows two individuals walking onto this property. It's surveillance video. And shortly after those two individuals walk onto the property, flames started over near that building that's now charred out in the distance. Incredible video overnight of the fire ripping through a haunted attraction here known as the Catacomb at Fright Acres. South Metro firefighters working through the early morning hours to contain the blaze. It could have been worse. Could have been a lot worse. We're grateful no one was injured. At daybreak, the damage becoming more clear. Crews using front end loaders to put out a hay fire. The fire moved to a big pile of hay that I had. Mike Smith's family has owned Flat Acres Farm since 1948, launching a pumpkin patch and fall festival about a decade ago. My oldest son started here and then the rest of our kids, they're all adults now and on their own, but this was their very first real job. It's a very special place and in fact, you know, the community that comes here, come in and out with their children and their families, they're going to be devastated when they hear what happened. It's a lot of fun to see all the little people, 10 and under. That's our market group right there. Mike says the fire is no doubt suspicious. There's no accidental way it could have happened. Yeah. Because at that time of day, there's no electricity in the building because we got it all shut down entirely. No electricity, no flammables, no gas. His business partner, Steve, runs the haunted house and said in a statement, while we're devastated by the vandalism as a premier attraction for the community, we will persevere and continue through this season. You know, I'm thankful. They bring so much joy to the, not only the town of Parker, but people come from all over. So again, investigators still not ready to release that surveillance video to the public showing two individuals walking onto this property shortly before the fire. We'll keep you posted on when that happens. As for Flat Acres Farm, they're going to open this weekend just as they were scheduled to do. They're scheduled to be open Wednesday through Sunday, which is Halloween, and that was expected to be their closing day anyway. So they'll be open from 10 to 6 Wednesday through Sunday. They're hoping you'll come out and support them. For now, we're live in Parker, Russell Haythorn, Denver 7.